Good evening, everyone. Thank you for joining me for Monica S. Martinez Live with my special guest, Aaron Paul. So last week we were having difficulties with YouTube. I have the YouTube broadcast going as well. Um, hopefully people on the YouTube channel will come over to the Facebook side and join us for Monica S. Martinez Live. But those of you who don't know who I am, I am Monica S. Martinez. Okay. And I'm trying not to touch anything, Aaron. You see, I'm going to keep my hands here so that I don't have any issues, right? Because I'm like, I don't want to touch anything. <laughs> Guys, if you have questions, feel free to inbox me. Questions for Aaron, for me. And we thank you again for joining us week after week, even though we've had technical difficulties and all of that. So we appreciate you coming here. Oh, so really, oh no, thank you. So really quickly, um, what's the matter with the sound? Emma saying sound, what? What's going on with the sound? Let me see. With the sound. Okay. All right. I got, I got the sound on my face, Facebook. So I think if you just hit your media button to go up for volume, media, I think we should be good. So um, really quickly, everyone, I want to just give out a couple of shout outs. And the first and foremost goes to, I always have to do this one first because this is like my favorite, favorite, favorite gadget. These headphones, these are gaming headphones from GNA.com. And I especially like them because, oh, aren't they cool? Yeah. This, oh, this is only one side, but here's the other one. They're cool because you can use them for Skype, gaming, um, you know, just chatting on the phone. And I keep them in my purse because they're portable. So it's really Brilliant. awesome. And the sound is crazy, crazy on them because it just puts everything out. Like, you can't any hear any outside noise, which is awesome. Wow, wow. So Aaron, um, since we already have you live, I, you know, I normally do a couple of things, so we'll, okay. do, them, we'll do them together while we have you. Um, if you wanna tell our audience a little bit about you, that would be great. Okay, sure. Okay, I'm a pop dance recording artist. Um, my name is Aaron Paul. I'm originally from London, um, but I've been in the US for a number of years now. Um, I've just released um, my second solo album, um, Electric Erotic, which is out right now on iTunes or any other digital download um, retailers. Um, I'm currently on tour. Um, I'm my, can you hear me? Yes. I'm currently on, um, presently on my tour um, called the Every Life Matters Tour, which is going up and down the East Coast of various spots throughout the summer, right through to October. Um, I am doing some dates in New York City, so anyone that wants, you know, wants to find out where I am, come and see me perform, please come and join me. Um, you can find out all the information at www.aaronpool.dance, um, or you can find me on Facebook. Um, I'm very active on there. Um, I post photographs, I chat, I let people know what's, what I'm doing and, and all other things, so I welcome everybody to join me there. Um, so I'm, I'm, I have a pass. I used to be in a boy band um, that was formed by Simon Cowell, and we were the first the first kind of catalyst idea for the whole American concept. So my project actually started that whole thing um, and I was the lead singer for it. Um, we had a number of, of hit records all, out, all throughout Europe. Um, and then I kind of jumped ship and came to the US um, and tried to do my little solo thing, but it didn't quite um, take off as, as expected. Um, so fast forward, you know, um, a lot of years, um, to present day, it's now finally catching fire and um, people are now paying attention to Aaron Paul. Um, I've released two albums. I had the first album, Raw, which is also on iTunes, and I've just released the second album called Electric Erotic. Very nice. And um, is it erotic? Obviously, electric erotic. Yeah, there's, there's, a little, there's a little bit of sexy going on through there. You know, it's, it's dance music. Um, they could, you know, because I'm a pop dance artist. But I incorporate everything. I incorporate a little bit of R&B. I incorporate a little bit of rock. So, and I write all my songs. Um, but because I'm mo mostly considered a dance music artist, um, I put the little 
erotic in there to kind of give it a little bit of sexy. Well, wait, well, what's sexy to you? What, what's considered <laughs> sexy to you? Everything is sexy. Everything is sexy. Um, I hope that, you know, this, this, I've kind of um, put everything on the album. Um, I write from the heart. Um, I write from experiences. And, and I write, you know, I consider I write the truth. And, and however I'm feeling on that particular, you know, moment of particular record. So whatever's sexy on that day when I'm writing, then that's what, that's what sexy is. Nice. So, as you know, I'm an erotic author, poet, right. educator. So, you know, basically, there are no inhibitions. You lose your inhibitions when you right. enter right. my door. Yeah, I get it. So, I, I want to know, like, what kind of verses are you using for your erotica? Like, I, can we can we get a sample? Um, well, I have a song um, on the album called Sexy Dirty Talk. It's one of the records. Sexy dirty talk? Yeah, Wait. sexy dirty talk. You're my um, kind of guy. <laughs> <laughs> so that kind of talks about, you know, when you're in that moment of, of passion or um, you know, lust or, or, or need, um, you know, you kind of the song talks about having your partner talk to you, um, you know, however dirty they want to get that's gonna get you going and more more into the into the into the act at the time. Um, You've got a text message. Sorry, my phone talks right. to me all the time. <laughs> it tells me I'm beautiful. It reminds me. Nice, nice, nice. So you know, it, it, and that's just it, that's just one element of, of erotica that I've got on the album. Um, Trying to figure, that there's another one. Um, there's the, the title track, which is called um, "Electric Erotic," and that basically talks about you know having that one and only individual that just you know it's just fire. You know it. It, whenever you're together, it's explosive. Whether it's you know in, in your in your sexual intercourse, or even when you they're just being in their presence with you, you just can't get enough of them. You actually become addicted to them, or you're a feeling for them. So that's that's the title track of the album called Electric Erotic, and it just means that, you know, it's, it's there's fire, there's voltage, there's electricity, there's passion, there's lust. You know, it's just all this kind of emotion going on. I talk about on that record. Can you give us a sample? Um, singing or lyrics wise? Either way, either or is fine. Okay, I so now I'm going to re um, remember the words. Oh, so we <laughs> want electric erotic. Um, all right. When we touch, I feel a joy in my heart. You light a spark. Feel the volume jump up real slow. Let the voltage explode. Caress me, undress me. Do what you want to me. There you go. Nice. <laughs> I like it. I like it. I like it. So, um, you will be performing this Saturday, correct? Yeah, I'm coming. I'm thinking I'm coming down to meet um at this um, the sip and chat an event in New York City. So I'm coming down to you know do a meet and greet. I'm going to sign posters, bring CDs, you know, and and be part of the discussion that um that Dillis is doing. Um, right, can you and, give people the time and um, the place where you're going to be? Um, actually, I don't have it in front of me. Uh, <laughs> it's in New York City, but check out um, you know, my website, www.aaronpool.dance. That will give you the website. Or also, Dillis has, has all the information. I just don't have it in front of me. <laughs> and I don't have my computer right now. Just, I'm using my phone. Okay, so let me grab up that information right quick so people know exactly where you're going to be this weekend. Um, I have an event coming up as well, so I'm going to talk about that too. But let's okay. get your oh, event. But you're coming to this one, right? Yes, I will be there. That is the plan. I definitely plan on being there. Yeah, it's going to be really nice. It's, you know, we're going we're gonna to sit and talk. We're going to get you know, meet and greet, take photographs. I'm going to give out CDs, posters, and all kinds of stuff. Okay, so it's going to be on June 10th, which is this Saturday. Saturday right. Wait. Oh, this doesn't have the information. That's real nice. I went to her <laughs> cover. I went to her cover photo thinking like, oh, I got this covered. <laughs> no. It's on their page. Work out. Um, maybe oh, look God. under her events or something. Yeah, I have to look for her event. What is this? The 
says sip in chat, right? I have to type this. Sip in chat. Where is she? Is that her? Oh, here we go. It's going to be held at 353 Studios, located 353 West 48th Street, Studio B. Can I have the time, Dillis? And are you able to see uh, Aaron? Because I have people indicating that they can't see him. Um, let's see. Sorry. I think it's at 7 p.m. this Saturday, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, I believe that's, that's right. That sounds great. Right? Like that. that sounds about right. 7 p.m. Let's see. Go to shop. What is she talking about? Okay. Wait. Here we go. Um, Dillis, you could see him, right? Because I'm getting indications. I'm getting inboxes from people saying they can't see him. They could only see me and hear me. So. Um, am I going to do something? Because you can see me, right? I can see you. It's to totally fine. Oh, okay, guys. It's 4 p.m. I'm sorry. So here we go. Aaron Paul will be at the Sip and Chat movement with Dillis on Saturday, June 10th, 4 p.m. at 353 Studios, 353 West 48th Street, Studio B as in boy, New York, New York. So make sure to go and check out his sexy electric erotica that he just gave you a sample of. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Verena says she sees you. So, oh, okay, so um, I think that, Alan, you are just having issues. That's all you. Um, she but let us know me. if that works. So, so some people can see me, then? Yeah, Raina and Dillis says they can, they can see you. A few other people said that they can see you. So, yeah, we're good. I think Alan may be Thank having goodness. technical difficulties. <laughs> <laughs> so, all right. Um, I have to give up really quickly since we're all on, you know, this whole sexy talk and sexy erotica. Um, everyone, I just want to remind you that we have erotic rendezvous at Casa Lounge this weekend, June 9th, from 8 p.m. to 11 p.m. Casa Lounge. Join me. Our feature of the night will be Venus White and hosted by D. Essence. And Casa Lounge is located at 3607 East Tremont Avenue. So make sure to come through. Venus will be on the featured. And I'll probably just pop up and go ahead and uh, spit some erotica just because. And we have <laughs> an open mic. <laughs> Are you going to be here in the city on Friday? On Friday? Um, I'm trying to think. I think I don't think I am on Friday. Oh, I, I, I am. I'm, I've got an event. I've, I'm doing an um, event at the, the Slipper Room. Oh, okay. So look at that, guys. He has. Oh, you both look fabulous. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Oh, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> um, so you have another event on Friday. So tell people yeah. about your event on Friday. Um, I'm performing for an event called. Um, Gays Against, um, Gays Against Guns, which is at the Slipper Room here in New York City. Oh, very nice. What time is that? What time is your event Friday, Aaron? Hello? Hello? Yes, what time is your event on Friday? We lost you there. Yeah, I lost you. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I don't know what happened. That's fine. What time is your event? Um, I believe I'm on stage at about 8.30. Okay. So um, people, visit Aaron Paul's website. You want to give off your website so they know where to catch you? Yeah. www.aaronpaul.dance www.aaronpaul.dance Correct. Yep. Okay. That's excellent. So, um, Aaron... I have to, you know, do some sex stuff right now, okay? Yeah, go ahead. So you gotta Bye. share, you know, you gotta share your spotlight a little bit. All right. So guys, Bye. I wanna, <laughs> I wanna give out. Um, 
Oh, yeah, you might want to drink because I'm about to stand up and show people some stuff. So um, first and foremost, <laughs> <laughs> we want to thank Taino Inc. for the Happy Coming t-shirts. Can you see those? Can you see that? <laughs> All right. Isn't that nice? Yeah. Oh, let me step over here. That's a better view. Yeah. So we want to say happy comings. I'm all about the happy comings. <laughs> so we want to say Taino Inc. <laughs> Taino Inc., thank you for our T-shirts, um, for printing them. We're awaiting for some panties. They'll be available this Friday again at Casa Lounge. Come and check me out at Casa Lounge on Tremont in the Bronx from 8 p.m. to 11 p.m. We are doing erotic rendezvous with Venus White as our feature of the evening. We have an open mic. D Essence is hosting the event. So join us. And she's from Get In Line Radio, in case you don't know. She, that's where she's going to be joining us from. And I'm really excited. So, Aaron, how do you feel about having toys in the bedroom? So, do you know what? <laughs> I'm the wrong. I prefer the real thing. You prefer the real thing. I'm a bit, I'm a bit boring with the toys. I rather, you know, I've not had much experience with toys because um, I think I, I, I prefer to have the real, the real thing, personally. Oh, but the real thing I, is amazing. However, yeah, yeah absolutely. Right, and it's been funny. I'm a, I'm a real novice when it comes to toys. This has never been something I've gone to um, with the, with the right person. If I was comfortable enough, I'm absolutely sure. Uh, but I'll be careful not to laugh because the stuff that like that kind of brings into the equation, I get a bit like a bit shy, I think. So I kind of laugh. I would, my first reaction would be laugh. If it feels good, absolutely, I would roll with it. Absolutely. Okay, wow. Well, because I'm an educator and the owner of Tantalizing Productions, we go out, we go ahead and we educate um, couples on how to keep the spice in their relationship, right. as well as uh, women and men for self-pleasure. Because I believe that everyone should have an orgasm daily. Absolutely. Right? Oh. <laughs> I believe that sex is the fountain of you. It's not more, right? <laughs> right, exactly. I mean... Just not one. I mean, you should just have orgasms, period. <laughs> as many as you can a day. I'm with it. I'm with it all. Uh, oh, Raina, um, Raina says you have a lovely accent. So thank you, okay. Raina. Definitely not my thank accent because I'm in New York. Aww. <laughs> I'm from London, so that's where my accent's from. <laughs> yeah, so um, they're loving, loving, loving your accent here. I'm getting uh -huh. inboxed. Alan, let me know whether or not you were able to get back online and if you can see, because I don't see you commenting anymore. So I want to know if you can see him. But um, so back on the toys, I do a tri-monthly club on tantalizingproductions.com where okay. you can go ahead and you can, oh, thank you, my beautiful niece. She's like, hey, auntie, sexy auntie. Hey. <laughs> hey. Um, so I do a tri-monthly club where you could go and sign up on tantalizingproductions.com where you get bo boxes quarterly and they will have full-size toys, they will have lubes, they will have samples um, because we're all about the happy comings. So right. uh, hi, Kathy. And Michelle says you're so cute. Hi, Michelle. Uh, <laughs> <Thank you. laughs> Everyone's joining. Yay! Thank you, guys. <laughs> now so, you're going to be shy now. Now I'm like, oh. <laughs> <laughs> right. And, I, and let me let me remind the people on YouTube that we are over here on Facebook. So join us on Facebook Live on Monica S. Martinez. All right. So the first item that we talk about for the last couple of weeks is the silver bullet. Okay. So you don't know anything about any toys? I don't. I mean, I, I mean vibrators, but I don't know the individual names. I don't know. I mean, I know you can buy them. Yes. You know, okay. Places, I, I really don't have much experience with toys. It's, it's never been something my go-to. Okay. So this here is the silver bullet. Can you see that? Yeah. Okay. Okay. So. And is that for, for the female, right? Well, I'm, I'm about to explain. <laughs> this here is great for 
breast stimulant, clitoral stimulant, and also on the guy's scrotum. So, right. you know, you hold that in your hand because that's one of the G spots is right. the scrotum. Right. Mm -hmm. So ladies, you can hold that in your hand and put this behind his back in, in essence, if you will. And that uh, <laughs> will send nice vibrations over to him. And it's also great if you host it here and you do oral sex because it sends the vibration oh, really? through that way. Yeah, because I'm all about the happy comings. Absolutely. <laughs> so this little device provides lots of pleasure. So make sure to visit tantalizingproductions.com if you want to know more about what's in the tri-monthly box. And Erin. Mm -hmm. We're going to do the next one, which okay. is one of my favorite. Oh, people are saying, hi, beautiful. Um, hey, beautiful Erin Paul. And girl, she said she got three silver bullets. Woo! <laughs> <laughs> Make sure to come, to come and get some more on Friday, guys. I'll have some on hand. And again, I'll have the t-shirt. So make sure you come join now. us. She's got three and I got none. I, will, I need one. <laughs> yes, you need one. So when I see you on Saturday, yes. I, I'm just going to give you one because yes. I want you to have lots and lots and lots of pleasure. Absolutely. <laughs> so the next item um, that's in the tri monthly box is the coochie cream. Woo. Coochie, cream coochie cream is great right. for razor bumps, ingrown hairs. You can use it on any part of the body to shave. And guys can use this on their face, too. So, ladies, you can send your guy out with coochie on his face. Really? So, and it also prevents, yeah, it prevents all the redness that happens. Yeah. This is really good. And because we believe in multipurpose under tantalizing productions, we can use it as conditioner to make our hair nice if you run out in, um, run out of it. Right. You know, at home, the hair conditioner, so... That's that. And Erin, I think people are asking, Venus, I bet you do. Oh, God, they're having all kinds of conversations going on. <laughs> um, Aaron, can you let everyone know where they can reach you, what your sites are again? Yeah, erinpool.dance, um, www.erinpool.dance. That's A-A-R-O-N-P-A-U-L dot D-A-N-C-E. Dot dance, Aaron Paul dot dance. And I'm on Facebook under Aaron Paul. I'm on um, Instagram at Aaron Paul Music. I'm on um, in, sorry, Twitter at AP Music and Facebook under Aaron Paul. Very nice. Guys, I hope you are tuning in to Monica S. Martinez Live. We're here every Tuesday at 8.30. We started on YouTube. We are now moved over to Facebook Live while YouTube is open as well, just in case you are visiting me there. We're asking that you come over here. And our special guest tonight is Aaron Paul. So, again, thank you for joining us. And he is a singer. He has electric erotica. The so, album. And the he'll album be I got now is electric erotic. Oh, the album. How many? How many um, tracks are on that? Um, there's. I have eighteen songs on on the electric erotic. Eighteen songs. Eighteen songs. Yeah. Jesus. That's a lot of songs. How right? do you remember all of that? I know, right? <laughs> Trust <laughs> me, I don't know how. I don't know how I do. But people say like, do you lip sync. No, I mean, it depends on what the show is. Sometimes you do, sometimes you don't. I mean, but I rehearse and make sure I'm on my on my game. Um, people are saying you are really low, can't hear him well. Um, if you could get closer to the phone, I think that maybe that'll help. Is that better? Can you hear me now? I could hear you. <laughs> oh, you're throwing kisses to the audience? Nice. Thank you. So is that better, Kathy? Can you hear him now? Kathy, can you hear me? Kathy, calling Kathy. <laughs> I think I think they're saying yes. So you're good. So guys, you can visit me on all social media sites under Monica S. Martinez in Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, YouTube, MonicaSMartinez.com. 
uh, Facebook here live, Monica S. Martinez, tantalizingproductions.com. So, Aaron, mm -hmm. what do you think about spanking? Hi, Jackie. Thank you. Hi. As long as, as, long as <laughs> see, I don't like pain. Um, see, you don't like pain? No, to me, sex shouldn't, shouldn't be painful. Not, no. But I do have a high tolerance of pain, naturally. But when it comes to sex, mm, no. But if, if it works for somebody, then go ahead. Okay. So no flogging for you? No flogging for me, no. Not if it's, no it's going to be something that's going to hurt, no. But, but during pleasure, you don't feel much pain when you're receiving pleasure. Right. See, I, see I, have very, like, I have very sensitive nipples, right? And mm -hmm. if someone, someone bites my nipples really hard, then it, it, it loses its sensitivity and become, now becomes pain. And I have to say, no, you slow down, you know, suck down. <laughs> but I know what you're saying. If, 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 you're, if you're that aroused, maybe in the moment, your, your endorphins are stretched out even higher, so maybe you can block out some of the pain. I can mm -hmm. try that. I would try it, but if, it, if, if it's painful, then it's a no-no. And if it's painful with sex, then no for me. But maybe I might meet the right person that can get that, you know, can get me past that point. Right. I just don't think that you have met the right person to get you past anything because you don't have any toys. I wanna <laughs> I wanna lighten up your life and I wanna <laughs> I want you to be smiling because that's all happy coming smiley smiles, well, you know? And you're, and you're probably absolutely you're absolutely right. I've not met that one person who, who is, is met me let me be able to explore in that in those areas sexually. Right, because the bedroom is supposed to be a safe haven, a non-judgmental, -jud you know, right, place. It be, yeah. Right, Absolutely and a safe right. space. Mm -hmm. uh, Venus says, sometimes I need a good spanking. She is out of control, girl. I'm going to get you on Friday. I'm going to have my <laughs> red and black leather whip with me. You are going to get it, girl. Get it. So um, I'm not sure. <laughs> I'm getting all distracted. The ADD is kicking in because I'm reading the comments and I got to pay attention. <laughs> to you. <laughs> Whoa, wait. I got to make sure I don't forget stuff because my assistant has her boyfriend watching me. And if, if I like screw up, he critiques the whole thing. You didn't do this. You didn't do that. You didn't do this. So I got to make yeah. sure I'm on point. So really quickly, we had a couple of weeks back, we had a dominatrix on. Okay. Right. And I got like really excited because I was like, oh my God, you know, we're going to, you know, dive into this world and it's going to be great. I got like super excited. I started pulling out all, all kinds of toys because mm -hmm. she was coming on. And do you know that she doesn't like any toys? Oh, she doesn't. Oh, she doesn't. She, no, she was a spiritual dominatrix oh oh I, i've oh. never heard i've never heard of that before me neither <laughs> it was a first for me because look i i got all excited i bought out the whip right i had this little flogger and i was like yay i get to talk about the flogger i get to talk about all kinds of things right, and right. turns out she was just a spiritual person and it was so it, read the bible of, the quran she no, it was more understand. like, what did she say? She said she would think in her head what she wanted done to her, and then the guy would do exactly what she thought. Oh, okay. And I was like, she got me all messed up because apparently I must not be thinking the right things. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wait, I was like, like wait a minute. minute. I, she she she's just taps yeah. into an energy then that's able to control what she wants right but she says it would happen for like two three hours and i was like girl i don't oh. even want sex to go past an hour by then i'm tired i want to go to sleep well, it shouldn't what? last She's longer you know than I that read her book then because i'd be interested in that <laughs> <laughs> yeah it was it, it was a lot of fun and i you know like i said i got like overly excited i like right. brought out the nipple clamps you see well, these if it, if it makes see if it Make sex go longer because I'm one of those people I don't believe in quick sex. I mean, quick sex is fun and good, yes, but I like you know, if you can, if it could be a, 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 a moment of time you know, and it's stretched out, I think that's so much better. All that work to 
just for five minutes is to me is not not enough. Oh no! I mean, quickies when necessary. Yes, absolutely. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hi, Nicole. Um, Hi. Nicole, I'm waiting for you to call me so we could talk. Um, <laughs> quickies, quickies are okay. Quickies That's are fun. okay. I mean, they're, they're in the moment. If you're out and about, and it's in the moment, great. Yes. Right at I'm, someone's I'm party, be... go to yeah. the bathroom, right. you know yeah, that kind of thing. That's fine, but I'm just saying overall sex. Overall. Overall sex, I, I don't think it should go past an hour. I mean, really? that's a little ridiculous. Really? Ain't he past an hour? Look, I got responsibilities, okay? <laughs> yeah, we so an hour, hour is good for me. So you've got, you got to lock down the time and set it up right that you, that you can get enough in at the, in that time. That's what I think. But we, we, I mean, we, we, the stuff that you mentioned, the, the basic stuff, and plus the stuff you mentioned, the, you know, the toys, plus the spanking. I mean, you can stretch sex out. You know, in stages, you can have to Oh, absolutely. I'm right. saying, you know, foreplay is necessary, right? Right, right. yeah. Because, you know, you got to lick it before you stick it kind of thing. Right, 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 right. And also... Yeah. So and definitely take you your time. <laughs> and <laughs> when you do have an orgasm, it doesn't need to stop there either. Take a break. Right, see, I got people saying past an hour is ridiculous. Really? Um, some, some, one, one woman said, Nicole actually says all nighter, girl, you pulling all nighters. What you listening to Jodeci? Like, girl, I can't. <laughs> well, I'm, I'm listening to more than Jodeci, love. I'm listening to three or four albums when I'm, when I'm down. <laughs> three, four hours? Jesus yeah, I mean, Christ, I'm going to need. It depends on the vibe, you know. And, on the vibe. Uh, I, no, yeah. I, I don't want to do three, four hours. That's. That's that's way I too mean, long. You take breaks. You take a nap and then wake back up again, and you know you go back. Oh, home. that's different. You you're talking about taking breaks, but I'm talking about the actual act. Like, well, like it, it depends know. on it depends on the chemistry and the, and the time that you have in the person. But I I personally like, and I tell people if, I, if we're gonna have sex, I'm not a quick sex person. I like a, a long a, mo a, a moment in time. <laughs> mm -hmm. Sex, well, sex is good, like you said. At the, it depends where you are and what you've got going on. But if I want to do all that work, I, I want I want to stretch it. I want to have it for hours. Yeah, but I mean, you gotta have breaks. There, there has to be yes, breaks yeah, in yes, between absolutely. that. We're not talking like four no, hours stop. going straight. I mean, then that's different. If I got if I got a Saturday free, that's fine. We can spend all day in bed with you know breaks, wow. and we can keep you, going you at it for as long. I, I, let me tell you something. I love my toys because sometimes the job doesn't get finished and sometimes you have to finish it, you know, because sometimes it takes yeah, us women true. longer to achieve an orgasm than it does men. Did I lose you again? No, we hear Hello? you. Can can you see? Can you hear us? Yeah, I'm back on okay. now. All right. Yeah, no, you're fine. Everyone can hear you. I'm I'm telling you, I'm getting distracted with all these comments and stuff. The ADD is kicking in. <laughs> so Nicole says, I want to I want I want to be sore the next day. She wants to walk around like she just rode a horse. She wants to be, so. she wants to be crippled. Yes, yeah, she wants she <laughs> wants she wants what I call cockitis. That's what she well, wants. Well, and how are you gonna how you <laughs> You better make sure you had to take your um your painkillers, love. <laughs> that she's gonna need painkillers. <laughs> nice. She nice. better get some Advil in her bag. <laughs> <laughs> no, she wants. She, she wants. She wants that kind of that raw, you know, thrown around the room kind of sex where she's beat up. Oh, you know? the, I I like it rough type. Oh yes, pull the hair, spank the booty. That's mm, it. Yeah. That's nice. But then you then you pay the consequence the next day. You're in pain the next day. That's okay. And the sex bruises are really like love notes. That's all. Okay. You can <laughs> you can wear them as, as proud badges or trophies. This was this was basically. My night. I got one. Yeah. Here. This was this was my night last night. <laughs> this 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 mark right here. <laughs> <laughs> I'm limping and. I'm you know. <laughs> So, Aaron, really quick, can you tell our audience because we got new members joining us? Can you um tell them tell them uh, where they can find you again? On my website, www.aaronpool.dance. That's a a r o n p a u l dot d a n c e. Aaronpool.dance. 
Kim says, real men leave real marks. Ooh, wait. <laughs> <laughs> Love marks. Let's get that qu you know, quote. Really to quick. To cover it up. She's got makeup to cover it up. Makeup. That's right. Makeup co covers the hickeys and stuff, guys. Yes, Evelyn, we can see your comments. She said, what did I miss? Girl, yes, well, you haven't missed much. We're just talking to Aaron. You know, we already yes, went over yes, the yes, silver yes. bullet. <laughs> we went, we went over the coochie cream. We're about I'm to get I'm into my silver bullet and my coochie cream. I got you. I, I'm That's telling you, awesome. I'm gonna, I'm gonna definitely give you a silver bullet because you know, happy comings. I'm all about the happy comings, right? See, right. so we gotta do that again, right, guys? Get your t-shirts to this Friday. Those happy comings, you know can you see that? I would wear that, Monica. I, I would you would wear this? Shirt. I would wear Wait, on, I on the red carpet. With, on the red carpet? Absolutely. Yeah, we're, we're going to have happy. them. And I'll, I'll show on the red carpet, and I'll just like that. Happy comings, everybody. Happy comings. <laughs> yes. <laughs> I'll see. No, I'll do it, too. I, I, I would so love that. Right. So hopefully we'll have the men's T-shirts um, ready uh, from Taino Inc., on Friday for our event um, because he's doing some different colors for me. We have like pink and white and we'll also oh, wow. get the boy shorts with the happy comings on them as well so that we'll have uh, matching sets. But I'm gonna talk about a vibrator now. Okay. okay. Are you okay with this? Absolutely. Mm -hmm. Okay. Because you are on Monica S. Martinez Live and mm -hmm. this is what I Monica know, does. <laughs> Okay, so guys, in the tri-monthly box, you will also get a full-size toy, as I indicated. And sometimes the toys will vary. Vibrators are a matter of preferences. So if you've never used the vibrator before, ladies, I suggest that you start off small with one of our starter vibrators. And one of our starter vibrators I have here with me tonight is called the Jungle Jiggler. All right. So he actually. I'm jiggling, looked, I'm jiggling already. Look. You're jiggling. <laughs> jiggling, baby. <laughs> so the jungle, the jungle jiggler provides pearl stimulation, which I'm going to turn this on. Can you hear him? Yep. So this here actually goes into the vagina, and this is what sends off the vibrations over to the ladies while the dolphin is working onto the clitoris. So that's a double, double stimulant double that stimulation. is happening. Yeah, happening all in one shot. And this particular guy rotates left to right, which is awesome. So if you want the sensation like to turn. Yeah, he, he's, the pearls go in like left to right, left to right, right to left. Oh. So you can turn those at the click of a button. So again, vibrators are a matter of preference. So always start off small because the latex, you know, reacts differently than the actual oh. real thing. Right. So um, ladies, visit tantalizingproductions.com to talk about your quarterly boxes. Feel free to inbox me if you have any questions on any of the toys that we carry. I answer all my clients' questions and all that fun stuff. Erin is going to be at the Sip and Chat this Saturday. It's Saturday. 4, 4 to 8 p.m. at 353 Studios, located at 353 West 48th Street, Studio B. And feel free to visit my publicist page, Dillis Sip Chat Liaison Victoria, if you want to be on this show, if you want to book me, if you need media marketing that's what she is here for and yes evelyn we see your comments and let me make sure it will carrie is saying hi dillis hi carrie <laughs> let's see we got this going here too and aaron i don't mm -hmm. know if you um if you are on my page hi carrie thank you we love you too. Um, if you are on my page, I am a shoe fanatic. Like I'm addicted to oh. heels. 
Yeah. Okay. So I usually post during the summer. I usually post every day a different shoe, and we've been having a pretty crappy summer. So mm -hmm. I've been like slacking on my duties as far as the shoe of the day. You know, and you haven't been inspired, right? I really haven't, and I try. I try to. I try to channel in, you know, spring. And sometimes I'll just wear my open toe sandals anyway. But let me remind you, ladies, that if you're wearing open toe sandals, make sure that your feet are on point. You are moisturized. You have your toes oh. painted. Nobody wants to see your anything that looks discombobulated. Right? <laughs> yes. Yes. So I have to show the shoe of the day. Okay. I love you too, Isabel. Um, I'm about to show you guys. Oh, let me double check with that happy coming t shirt. Can you see that? How nice is that? <laughs> All right. So let's see. I got to bring this down, I think, right? Let me see. So we can show the shoe of the day. Can you see it yet? Yep. All right. I have closed toes on again today simply because it's raining. And it's cold. So I have my little studded Steve Madden's on. Did you get to see them or did I do that too fast? Am I going to get in trouble? No, I saw them. I saw them. <laughs> okay. Good. It's supposed to be sunny all week. When? When? They're talking <laughs> rain. They said it's coming. I saw the news today. That's like, it's coming. In a few days, it's coming. Thank God. Well, I'm a Caribbean girl, so I need, I need, you need, you need the heat. heat. Yeah, but I when, need it get, when it gets too hot, when it's too hot, what do you do? I love it. I don't complain. Really? Never, oh. never, never, never complain. Oh, wow. <laughs> Venus is like, yes, she is right, ladies. Make sure those feet are right so these toes can be sucked. Ooh, foot fetishes. Do you have any, any fetishes, Aaron? Any fetishes? Um, not really. Nothing done out of the norm, I would think. I told you, I'm pretty boring. <laughs> I think you need to hang out with us. <laughs> I do. I need to come to one of your, your, your parties or one of your, the Happy Cummings party or something. Yes, you have to come. Um, I'm actually, like I said, we're going to be at Casa Lounge this Friday from um, 8 p.m. to 11 p.m. in the Bronx. Make sure to visit us there. And I also have another event coming up on June 29th in Brooklyn. So Let me just that, one. that one I can come yeah. to. Oh, you should. It, it, it's actually my my friend, um, Jamil. Mm -hmm. It's called the Sex Circle Toy Party. Oh. Yeah, it's, it's uh, LGBT friendly, mm -hmm. you know, Everyone can come to this party. Okay. June 29th from 6 p.m. to 8 p.m. So maybe I'll come to that one. Come Absolutely. On that one. Absolutely. Come. It's at um, the AHF Community Space located at 475 Atlantic Avenue on the second floor. Oh, so, guys, cool. if you want more information, it's posted on my page. And you'll see it, the sex Sex Circle Toy Party on June 29th. So make sure to visit us there. Aw, uh, happy comings to Venus. That's the hashtag on the shirt right here, right? Yeah. Happy comings, hashtag tantalizing. I love it. Those will be available this Friday and look. So make sure to come out and play with us. Venus White will be our feature. D Essence is the host. And um, yeah, Aaron, can you give everyone again one more time your location? Oh, he got, what happened to Aaron? I think he got disconnected, Dillis. Maybe his phone died, guys. But I believe it's Aaron Paul, Aaron.Paul.Dance for his website. Make sure to visit tantalizingproductions.com for the tri-monthly club boxes. I wish I was in New York. Uh, we wish we were in New York too. We miss you, Evelyn. It would be nice to see you, but don't worry. Soon we'll be traveling again. I've been quiet and back on my routine. 
Dillis, can you see what happened with Aaron and see if he got disconnected? Because he's not there anymore. Not sure why. Yes, Venus, we're looking forward to you hanging out. So it's Aaron Paul dot dance. That's the website for Aaron Paul. If you enjoyed his interview, um, oh, so let's see what's going on with him. Let's see if I hit show. Aaron, are you there? I'm here. Hello. What happened to you? I don't know. I was like, wow, he's just leaving us and doesn't even say goodbye. <laughs> no, I don't know what happened. I was there and I'm like, disappeared. Yeah, you were gone. We, we were looking at you and then you were gone. I don't know. I just disappeared. Okay, so now you're back. We're excited about that. I think he froze. Is your connection okay over there by you, Aaron? Maybe he's having connection issues, guys. There's not much I can do about that. So, um, again, visit me on monicasmartinez.com. Come see me here every Tuesday at 8.30. We'll have special guests. Visit me on tantalizingproductions.com if you're interested in getting to have more fun in your bedroom. We provide a whole line of adult novelties that will keep the smile on your face. And Aaron is coming back on, it appears. Maybe he just has internet issues because we were experiencing that um, separately. And there was no problems with YouTube today, of course, when I want to go over to Facebook Live, there would be no problems with YouTube. Let's see what's going on. Let me hit show again. Can you see Aaron. Yeah, I'm back. Just, keeps You're back. Out. It's you. It's me? It has to be. I don't know. Can you see me now? Well, now we're fine, right? You almost sound like the Verizon commercial. Can you hear me now? <laughs> <laughs> yes, we can see you. We can see oh, you now. Sorry, I think, I think it's got my phone. When, when I get a text message, it cuts out. Mm-hmm. Yeah, but that's fine. We were telling everyone where to go. So it was Aaron Paul dot dance, correct? Again. Aaron Paul dot com. Nope. Okay. Hello? His phone. There you go. Are you there? Can you hear us, Aaron? I think he's having more difficulties again, guys, and I apologize for that. So we'll see what's happening. Um, he's frozen on our end over here. Venus and Arena, you guys are having fun here. So, guys, visit AaronPaul.dance if you want to see him perform live, hear his audio. And by the way, guys, I meant to tell you that David Rodriguez and I did a track um, called Abuse Me. And I'm on his track, so I'm waiting for that LP to come out. And once that comes out, I'm going to make sure you guys hear it. I kind of wanted to give you a snippet of you it today. Now? Yes, we could hear you. It keeps Are you there? Out. Now, now it's fine. But you, cut, you keep cutting out. No, it has to be you. I don't. I, I, everybody sees me. We're good. I think you're, you're frozen again. <sighs> so maybe it is the be live issue. He froze. He froze. Yes, I know. So L. David and I created a track, LP. He asked me to jump on, and I gladly accepted. And I'm waiting for it to release. As soon as it releases, guys, I'm going to be posting it all over on all my sites so you guys can hear it because it is so freaking dope super 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 dope and i cannot wait for it to drop so visit his page too he's he's an amazing poet artist all of it he does it all so that's david rodriguez on facebook 
And we want to thank you all for those of you who joined us tonight. We are here every Tuesday, 8.30 to 9.30, with guests, without guests, um, rolling through all the technical difficulties that we are experiencing. And he's jumping back on. So this is hilarious. I have to laugh, guys. So again, a big shout out to Taino Inc. If you guys need t-shirts made, he is your guy. Him and Jeanette are, John and Jeanette are dope people. They actually work really hard to get things done really quickly. I'm waiting for our panties to come for the matching t-shirt. Oh, you're back. Aaron, he's freezing again. So I don't know who's worse, YouTube or <laughs> Believe. But either way, AaronPaul.dance, guys. Visit him. And we'll see if he comes back on, because if not, we're going to be ending the broadcast soon anyhow. Looking forward to hear Abuse Me. Yes, you have to. You 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 will love this Venus. It is so amazing. I'm gonna see if maybe we can play like little snippets of it on Friday. I'm gonna inbox David and ask him if he could send me the track so that we can play a little sneak peek into it, which would be really awesome. Uh, hopefully the DJ will have the equipment to do it or what have you. So if David lets me, do a little bit i'm gonna bring it anyway just in case he says yes so again visit me every tuesday here from 8 30 to 9 30. you could visit me on all social media sites monica s martinez on facebook instagram twitter monica s martinez.com tantalizing productions.com if you want to get a happier, you know, love life and, you know, have happy comings and smile because sex does the body good. Stay tuned on my page for the show of the day, especially in the summer, not so much in the winter. I'm more of a, I like to show my toes type of girl. So, hey, sexy, it's technical. If you mess up, try, try again. It's all good love. Thank you. Yes. We work through the technical difficulties at all costs, at all times. Um, we just smile through the show when stuff happens. But we want to thank Aaron for coming and giving us some of his time. And again, guys, make sure you visit us every Tuesday. I will be here live providing, you know, education on toys, questions. If you have questions for me, you feel free to, you know, go ahead, inbox me, ask, and I will answer as much as I can or willing to, because some things are meant to be private. <laughs> so visit me on Amazon as well. I have books out, guys. I have Dulce de Leche, Seasonal Husband, Twisted Cherry, Tantalizing Erotic Thoughts and Encounters. So you can find them on Amazon.com. You can find them on MonicaSMartinez.com. So thanks again, guys, for joining me. I want you guys to get sex wasted. And have a wonderful, wonderful, wonderful night. And thanks again. Mwah. Vessels.